Good afternoon people, how you all doing? Welcome to the channel. If you're like me, you've got your own bar down your garden or thinking of making your own bar down your garden, converting your chilling to a bar. Who doesn't love stocking up? One of the best parts of having your own bar, decorating it and stocking it with beer. You can't have a bar without beer. Treat yourself to another box of these little beers. So I thought I'd do a little unboxing, a little open up. Um, I did one before, these. this is from the company called Flavorly. I still recommend them. I'll put a link below. I don't think it'll be an affiliated link. It'll just, be, just click the link and see what deals they've got going on there. Um, they do like a monthly thing or they do, if you subscribe to their newsletter, in actual fact, I think if you click the link below, I think you should get some money off or some vouchers or whatever. And uh, we, we might both get that, I'm not sure yet. But anyway, I'll, I'll decide later on what I'm gonna do. Anyway, this is from a company called Flavorly. I think they deliver their beer within two to three days via DPD. This turned up just now. I've not opened it yet. I think it's very similar to the set I bought before. Um, if you subscribe to the newsletter or you've bought beers from them before, they do send you quite a few uh, regular uh, update newsletter and emails and the deals get cheaper and cheaper and cheaper. It works out about £1.30 a can, £1.10 a can. They're only the small little cans of beer. They're craft beers, <coughs> craft beers, a mixed, mixed bunch in this box. Um, it's like a beginner's type set. They're only a small little can. I quite like them because instead of going on a bit of a session with a load of pint and pint and pint after beer, the craft owls, um, they're a little bit of a tinier tin and they're a bit more of a tasting session, more than, more than a, a sort of mad session down the pub, you know. So I quite like them. This set, yet again, I was quite lucky because this one had two free glass. I'm a bit of a, if you look behind me, I'm a bit of a, a glass collector sort of thing, a glass holder. I've uh, got some nice glasses here. I've already got two glasses from Flavorly. And they're just right for these cans. This box contains, I think, the magazine that they send out, a packet of snacks, uh, and the glasses. I think there are two glasses in here, which uh, obviously I need washing first. But I might, I might crack open a little tinny and put it in one of the other glasses. I don't think I've got a flavoured glass here, but I've got, uh, I've got some small glasses that we can use. So um, let's have a look. Anyway, let me unbox it, see what we've got inside, stack them all up, have a nice little look, and let's maybe have a little tasting. Can't recommend this company enough, honestly. They are pretty cheap. And if you want to stock your bar up, it's an easy way of, of stocking your bar up, you know, instead of going down to shops. But um, obviously, we, we mention on my channel quite often B&M. b and is a good little place if you've got a B&M near you. I know some of the subscribers buy from Aldi's, uh, B&M's, Aldi's, B&M's. What's the other one? Lidl's, I think, do some nice cheap beers. But um, yeah, here we go. This is so what you get in the box let me turn that over so you can have a little look oh yeah you've got the craft beer textbook um as well so little book there flavoured thing there i'll bring these in a bit closer in a minute but basically that is what you get nope that's all on the floor i'll take these off what i'm gonna do well stacked look I can't remember the cans I bought in this set. Now, I think there's 34 cans or something, I'm not sure. Let's bring the um, bits and bobs in closer so you can see them up closer. I'll get the beers out, stack them up, maybe have a taste or two of one or two of them, and we'll see what we've got. First off, the flag flavourly uh, magazine that they send you in the box. I've gone, I have them now actually. Pack of snacks. I think I've got this set. You don't always get this. The Craft Beer Textbook by Johnny Garrett. All about craft beers. Uh, what is craft beer? How is beer made? What is malt? What are hops? Etc. Etc. So, little little um, afternoon read with a couple of quiet craft hours. I think we'll have some of that. So let me get the beers out one by one. See what we've got. Uh, California Comfort, four point four percent. I won't read them all out. Let's get, get these snacks and that out of the way. Let's put the snacks, the packet of snacks and the magazines on that to one side. And let's get the, um, save them for later on. Let's get the beers out one by one. I won't read them all out. I might go through a few of them and then we'll, I'll show you the old setup. California Common. Lovely little tins these are. Levitate Pal Owl. What else did I get? More. Nano Cask. Freedom IPL. Well, I'll quickly get them out and stack them up. And then we can take a, a little shot of them. 
I love little Kansas. I love little. They're cute. Aha, where's my glasses? Aha, there they are. Break them, don't break them. I'll show you that in a minute. All right, let's throw it on the floor. Two lovely glasses. I've already got two of these. Two lovely glasses you get. The flavoured glasses, which are perfect for drinking these hours. As I say, it's not like a session lager or anything like that. It's a nice, comfortable Sunday afternoon drink. Let me bring these a little bit closer so you can see. <clears throat> got four of these now. So they've got to be washed first. Put them up on the shelf first. We'll go and wash them in a minute. Right, let's get the beers, the rest of the beers out. Another one. I'll probably get another box of these before Christmas. Just to stock the old bar up, get some more lagers and that. So again, you don't just buy all your beers from one place. Flavely, a brilliant place to buy them from online. As I said, in Essex area, you've got your Lidl's, Aldi's, all the shops are doing great deals at the moment. I mean, I used to get used to go to uh, Asda for mine, to be fair. Um, what else the shops you got? you got, the, as I say, b and If you wanted some Owls, mixed bunch of Owls, b and do a nice selection of bottles. Right, let's stack them up in a minute. I remember I did this before my, in, a, in another video, but... Um, Oops. Any more we've got. Nearly there, nearly there. Yeah, I'll probably buy one more of these boxes before it's Christmas. That'll keep me going for a little while. Get down to B&M's. Get some hours from there. Oh, and also I want to get some... If you watch my other video, beer in a bag, I do want to get another beer in a bag for Christmas, so I'll be getting that in a couple of weeks time. In December. A little while yet. Well, sorry, it won't, not long, but uh, I want to get a beer in a bag. I've got these beers from Flavely. I'll probably get some uh, bottles of Owls from B&M. Probably get some beers and lagers from um, Asda, which is local to me. I'll be getting a beer in a bag from Mighty Oak Brewery. Um, if you look at my other videos, go through the list. I've got videos there where we interviewed and had a chat with one of the guys that works there. Um, they do uh, some real Owls in a bag in a box which you can put in your fridge and I'm going to pull that through the pump. Have a look for all the other videos, I've got plenty online and you can see me pulling the beer through the pump which is a nice way to drink the beer so I'm going to have a nice selection. Um, yeah if you've got your own bar down your garden or you convert in a shed, best way to get your beers, your beer in a bag, go to your local shops, there's loads of um, deals, there's loads of deals on at the moment but these, I can't recommend Flavely enough, Flavely.com, brilliant, good idea. I, th I think they sort of started out, they've become really popular during the Covid and that so um postcard series i mean the lovely little tins different i have one now i think oh, so they're all about 4.4 percent i think 4.4 uh what one's that going to see on that one so let's stack them all up heatway british parallel 3.8 let's dance follow me um a friend of mine put me onto an app called uh, untapped U-N-T-A-P-P-D I think it's uh, on the Play Store it'll be I'm sure it'll be on the Apple Store as well untapped follow me on there if you want John Goulding J-O-H-N G-O-U-L-D-I-N-G I've only just set up an account on there the idea is you take pictures of your beers and you give them a little rating for when you're out and about in your pub uh, not just down the pub as well you can do it for the, down your own little bar um, I might change account to Life of John, I'm not sure yet. I'm going to try and set this up as a little venue on Google Maps, I think, in the, in the, in the future. So we'll see what happens there. But um, yeah, untapped that. looks quite good. A friend of mine's on it, um, and he recommended it. It's a bit of fun, really, but you just rate your beers that you buy. For, so you buy beers from different shops, you take photographs, and then you open them, have a beer, and you rate your beers. Um, also, if you go down to your local pubs, or any pubs you go to, real hours, craft hours, craft beers, etc. You take a picture of your beer, or the pump or the can and then you rate it and you give it sort of comments you can give comments you know whether it's malty or powder in color etc etc so um let's just stack these beers up now and we'll take a little last shot there you go people girls and guys guys and girls 24 cans all lined up 24 cans two 
in my box I've got 24 cans, two, two nice little glasses there, which um, I have washed up already. 24 cans of beer, packet of snacks, a couple of magazines, well, a magazine and a book, a little tiny book. Um, I can't say tonight, they're gonna wobble about and knock on the load in it. So, if go on Flavor website, I can't recommend it enough to be kind of quite honest. If you look, this and if you sign up to their mailing list, they do send you deals, 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 deals. They get cheaper and cheaper. They went up about £1.30 a can. But they do, this is a small box, they do bigger and bigger and bigger boxes. But I think this was about 30 quid, I can't remember. Have a look at the comments, see if I put a link below. I think there'll be a £5 voucher off yourself, not a £5 voucher off of myself. I'm not 100% sure. It's some sort of affiliate thing they're doing at the moment. Right, I'm going to crack open a beer now, I think. I've chosen one out of the pile. Uh, wash the glass up. It's always better at the glass. I've got one called, it's from WBB, it's called Detour. Detour Parallel. I'll just read out the back. Um, take a detour with this super easy drinking pail, crammed full of truckle fruit and citrus flavours with a crisp, balanced bitterness. 330ml tin, like all the others, four point, I think this is 4.5%, so we'll crack open the beer. And have a little taste, and I'll put that on the app. Mm. Mm, oh, that is fruit, that's nice. <clears throat> Lovely that is. I can smell it. Gorgeous. Mmm. That's a nice one. Well, I'll go and whack that on the app. That's Detour Parallel. 4.5%. And as it says, it's fruity. Yeah, it is fruity. It's very, very nice there. I like that. So yeah, I'll be putting that on the um, untapped app. So yeah, please like, subscribe, pop over onto Facebook, do a hunt for a life of John on Facebook. We've got a little group of like-minded people on there that have got bars, etc. Uh, like, subscribe to the channel. Jump onto untapped, and you'll find me J O H N G O U L D I N G. And I think this will be my first beer on there. I think the idea is you take a photograph of the can and you rate the beer, etc., and where you bought it from. Uh, or what bar you drank it in. I'm trying, I'm trying to try and get this bar listed on there somehow. We'll see. Thank you for watching. Cheers. Have a good weekend. Bye bye.